Hey everyone, we're here at the Jets facility in Florham Park on the day DeBrickishaw Ferguson held his farewell retirement press conference. Just a few quick takeaways from, uh, from what uh, DeBrickishaw Ferguson had to say today. He really seemed at peace with his decision to retire. Um, you know, he said it was not because of CTE or concussion issues, which is, you know, what we expected uh, to hear. He was healthy throughout his 10-year career, only missed one snap since the Jets drafted him in 2006, started all 167 games of his career. A really remarkable streak of durability. Um, he said he was taken aback a bit by the Jets looking at some other left tackles this offseason. Remember, they had Calvin Beecham in for a free agent visit. Uh, that uncertainty did, he said, you know, t- take him aback a little bit, understandably so. So, uh, But he was not surprised that the pay cut stuff came up this offseason. He understood the structure of his uh contract was such with a $14 million cap hit, $10 million about in salary bonuses due to him, that he was going to you know, have to have those conversations at some point with the Jets, but he just decided in the end that he was not able to play at as high a level as he once could. Uh, and so DeBrickashaw Ferguson got a nice send-off from the Jets today, a lot of current and former teammates here in the house in Florham Park, and he rides off as the Jets now have Ryan Clady as his replacement, and we'll see if he can be as durable as Ferguson was uh, for so many years for this organization.